Hello everyone, Dr. Sanjeev here. In this lecture, we are going to discuss how to form plural nouns from singular nouns. And I have collected a few rules which are used to form plural nouns from singular nouns. You might be obviously using those tricks, you, uh, those rules to form plural nouns, but let me uh, tell you. And I have also collected some exceptions which don't fit into the rules and they are going to violate the rules so you are also to remember the exceptions I have also listed them down into my laptop so let us begin with the very simple way that we use to form plural nouns from singular nouns is by adding s or es into singular noun okay so any word if we have we use s in the ending of that particular word in singular form and we form its plural Let's say boys, B O Y, boy, we add S and we form plural, boys. Let's say girls, G I R L S, we add S in this particular word and we uh, form plural of girl from singular into plural, girls. There are few words which are always formed into plural by using E S at the end of these words. Uh, these words generally end in s itself uh, they end in sh and they end in ch or x so these four uh, points remember that they already end in s they end in ch they end in sh they end in x i give you a few examples <coughs> for example it is dish d i s h what is the plural of this dishes d i s h e s let's say this is glass g l a s s when we form plural of glass g, we say glasses g l a s s e s uh, see ox we form plural in different way but let's say box b o x what is the plural of box? Boxes. B O X E S. Match. M A T C H. Match. Cricket match. You see. What is the plural of match? M A T C H E S. Matches. So these are few words uh, which end in S already, S H C H and X, and they are formed into plural by adding e is into the end of these words there are few words which end in o and they are formed into plural by adding es like mangoes m a n g o e s okay but there are few words which end in o but they are not formed into plural by uh, using es they simply take s in the ending Let's say this is dynamo, D-Y-N-A-M-O, dynamo. The plural of dynamo is D-Y-N-A-M-O-S, not E-S, remember that. Kilo, K-I-L-O, kilos, K-I-L-O-S. Video, V-I-D-E-O, video. What is the plural of video? V-I-D-E-O-E-S, this is wrong. V-I-D-E-O-S, this is correct. Okay, so I give you the list of exceptions which are formed into plural by adding only S and these words already end in O. So these are the words I have noted down. They are dynamos, dynamo plus S, ratios, ratio plus S, logos, logo plus S, solos, solo, single, which you say plus S, kilos, kilo plus S only. Memento, M E M E N T O, जो आप लोग किसी occasion पे gift करते हैं. Mementos, only S. Quartos, Q U A R T O S. Shakespeare के place Quarto edition में शुरू में publish हुए थे. So Q U A R T O S, not E S. Pianos, piano, musical instrument, you know, and it is formed into plural by adding only S, not E S. Photos, P H O T O S. You already use photos in your daily communication. Then, commandos, C O M M A N D O S. Stereos, stereo plus S. Then, logo, logo, 
of anything plus s folio f o l i o shakespeare ke plays folio edition mein bhi aaye hue the folios only s then studios studio koi bhi studio ho plus s video videos zoos z o o s zoos chidiya ghar jo hote hain duos d u o s tobaccos t o b a c c o s tobacco jise surti aap kehte hain its plural is formed with s only then autos a u t o s autos casino c a s i n o s casinos memos m e m o s these are few exception which end in o but they are formed into plural by adding only s in the end now there is another way to form a uh, plural with the words which end in y when a word is ending in y and it is just or immediately preceded by a consonant then we turn y into i and we add es for example f l y fly f l y so y is ending word and l is just before y so now what we will do we will turn y into i and then we shall add es flies f l i e s jo makhi hai unhe aap log plural banate hain to flies mein f l y ko hum log kya bana dete hain f l i e s so y is turned into i and then we use es at the end of the word so this is the way that we use to form plural of the words which end in y and this y is already just immediately preceded by a consonant like you have story s t o r y y is preceded by r so we shall turn y into i and add es so stories okay i have just uh, pointed out these rules uh, so that you can understand and use these words uh, to form plural and be aware of the fact now we come to the next rule nouns which end in f or fe we turn this f or fe that comes in the ending of the nouns into v and we add se to form their plural as we did into the words which ended in y we turned y into i and we added es again the example is half h a l f we make plural of half in this way s a l v e s we have turned f into v and we have added es okay so there are few words which are formed into plural they end in f or f e but f doesn't change into v it remains the same and we just add s in the ending to form their plural i have listed down these words into my computer these words are chief the plural of chief is chief c h i e f s we don't turn f into v and add e s no this is not the rule with these words these are exceptions safe s a f e and the plural is s a f e s safes proof p r o o f the plural is p r o o f s believes b l i e f s gulfs g u l f s clips c l i f f s handkerchiefs reliefs r e l i e f s these are some words which are formed into plural by just adding s with even though they are going to end in f okay now there are few other words which are formed into plural in both ways uh, whether you turn f or f e into v and add e s or you just put s at the end of these words these are the words dwarf d w a r f we turn uh, their plural we can change f into v and add es or we just keep the 
uh, f uh, there into the ending of the word and add s only so d w a r f s is also correct d w a r v e s dwarfs is also correct other words are h o o f hoof jo gaib hain jangaro ke nail hote hain jise khur kaha jata hai hindi mein hamare yahan pe ye kaha jata hai so and this word is also formed into plural by adding s only h o o f s or you can just turn f into v and add e s h o o v e s both are possible other two words are scarfs s c a r f s you say s c a r f s or you say s c a r v e s a scarf se bana hua hai plural hai and w h a r f s warps और डब्ल्यू एच ए आर बी ई एस ये घाट होते हैं जहाँ पे सामान की लोडिंग और अनलोडिंग होती है स्पेशली ऑन द रिवर बैंक्स और शीशो सो वाप्स दीज आर फोर वर्ड्स विच आर फॉर्म इंटो प्लूरल एंड द एंड इंटो एफ और एफ ई बट वी कैन एड एस ओनली और वी कैन यूज द नॉर्मल वे यू टर्न एफ इंटो वी एंड एड ई एस द फ्यू मोर रूल्स which are used to form plural out of singular nouns first one is just we uh, change the vowel inside the particular word that is in singular like man men woman women so we are just changing the vowel inside m a n we turn m e n w o m e n it is plural formed from again from men लाउस एल ओ यू एस ई जिसे जू कहते हैं एंड प्लूरल इज एल आई सी ई दीज आर सम वर्ड्स टूथ टीथ फूड फीट सो द फ्यू वर्ड्स देर आर फ्यू वर्ड्स विच आर फॉर्म इन टू प्लूरल बाई जस्ट एडिंग ई एन एट द एंड इन टू सिंगुलर लाइक ऑक्स ऑक्सन चाइल्ड चिल्ड्रेन so these were few rules which are used to form plural from singular nouns but you have to very care be very careful while forming plural out of singular nouns some nouns have diff totally different plural forms that you have to uh, learn it from dictionary you search the word you look at the singular plural forms it is already written in good dictionaries like oxford advanced learner dictionary so be aware whenever you search any word into a dictionary try to know the plural form of these words and the spellings which are changing or the rules that don't apply on exceptional words so these were the things that i wanted to discuss in this video i shall meet you in the next lecture thank you for today